welcome to my little corner where there is no wrong way to play with paper. I hope you're having a great day. Today we are doing Simple Story Saturday. That is a fun, fun hop that I participate in once a month where the creators that also participate in it only use Simple Stories products. And it is so much fun. It's uh, I it just I have a ton of simple stories a ton because I, I think that they are one of the more affordable companies on the market they have beautiful papers some wonderful themed collections and I just enjoy it and I have so much I need to use it right so we're gonna do that today I am going to just like yesterday um, I am going to do another eight and a half by 11 photo because look, even this here, look, it got damaged. Now I'm still gonna scrap it. If you, I don't know if that is showing up in there or not, I can't see. But, you know, we leave things in frames when we move them or they get stored and somehow they get damaged. I need to get these out of their tubs and in their albums, like I said yesterday. Okay, so all the links are below. Check out everyone else playing along with Simple Stories Saturdays. I promise you will not be disappointed. I am using Simple Vintage Lemon Twist. I love this line, but boy, have I struggled to use this line. And I will tell you, so far out of this collection, I think I've gotten four layouts and I still have plenty of paper because I did buy the solids that went with it. Um, and every time I do it, it's one of my most popular <laughs> videos. I think everyone loves this color scheme, but I think everyone struggles using this line because what are we gonna do with lemons? But it doesn't have to be about cooking, it doesn't have to be about food. You have to think on a word play and don't be afraid to just put a photo you love with it. Don't be afraid to do that. That's what I'm doing today. We're gonna to see how it turns out, but I'm pretty sure it'll be just fine. So definitely pull those those collections out that you fought to get because they were out of stock all the time, like this one, and use them. You fought to get it, play with it. All right, so I simply matted again. Now this photo is horizontal instead of vertical, which is fine. I did cut it down just a tad, but the only reason I did that is because there was some water damage up on the top of this, number one, and it's still a little bit there, but I'm still gonna, you know what? It's my memory. It is what it is. I'm going to scrap it. And um, that, and this is the size scrap I had of this paper. <laughs> so I wanted it to fit on there. All right, so my title is going to be Live Life with More Zest. What toddler do you know doesn't do that? They do, don't they? They truly do. And I think I'm debating about maybe, I don't know, maybe even here. I was thinking this way, but maybe here and then just do one cluster going up the side here. An option. I do have some ephemera. Um, I had more, but I don't want butterflies, so I left those inside of there. I have the bits and pieces from Simple Stories. I do have the sticker sheet, so we may do some of that. And I do have frames. I don't know why I have so many frames, but by golly, I do. And look, I left a piece of a primer in there. We could use it. Eureka! <laughs> okay, so I have those things. Now, what if... Mm, I don't think that would work. I'd have to cut it down, which would be okay. I could, I could cut this down. Who's to say there's no rules, right? Like this, and then have this going there. Ooh, oh, but then it's covering his face. Not if I pull it over more though. Hmm, possibility, possibility. My only worry is this, when I cut this chipboard, because it's so thick, is it going to have a rugged, not so nice edge when I do it? And you know, the only way I'm gonna know y'all is if I do it, right? I mean, oh, I don't know. I have to think about that more. Let's build and see if I can make it work before I 100% decide <laughs> because I'm still on the fence. Oh, okay. The other thing I could do, now maybe I should just, time is the best spent with you. Yeah, see, I could kind of frame that one, but no, I, I don't wanna do that. It's gonna have to be this one, because I don't see how any of these others, I mean, this one might work. Ooh, 
That might work. Okay, see, look, because I really didn't want butterflies. Maybe we can make this more trial and error, y'all. That's what I do. That's the name of the plan around these parts. <laughs> if I were to cut that like so, okay, and then what if I put a couple of florals in here? All right, let's do this first. Let's one little floral. I don't know what all I got going on here, but we're going to make what we can, okay? Just like that. I'm okay with the bee. The bee's all right. Bee sweet. I like that. I'm covering up the duck. I'm okay with that. I have, have scrapped these photos before. This one is for juniors, so I'm all right with that. In general, especially when they're babies, I try not to cover their hands. I used to purposely um, let my kids have photos. I mean, I dressed them up nice, but I would um, take and make sure their feet, they only have little tiny feet and little tiny hands for so long. So I was really picky about that as a mom. <laughs> I really was. All right, let's see here. Maybe I could get a lemon in there instead of this. I don't know. I don't know that I'm sold on this and liking this. Hmm. I mean, I don't not like it. I can say that I don't not like it. I can't 100% say I do like it. So what if, new game plan, I were to cut this, have, literally, did I just literally go like that? Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Okay, what if I were to, maybe there shouldn't be no flowers. Maybe I should, this one has flowers, but it's not as large. What if I were to cut this right here and do that. Ooh, and then have the lemon. <gasps> okay, I I think I'm just gonna have to suck it up and do it. That That's, yeah, as much as I don't like that. Now, when I'm cutting these, I like to go like this because it's very easy for me. Yours truly is not one to cut things straight ever, ever. Even with a straight edge, I have a tendency to mess it up. So I'm gonna use my invisible ruler as Miss Terry calls it, and I'm gonna put some markings so I can do my best <laughs> to cut it right. And we're just gonna do it. I'm, oh my gosh, I almost stabbed myself. Who does that? Only me. Okay, maybe the edge wouldn't be so bad if we decided to go the other frame route. Okay, so we could tuck this under here maybe no that's not gonna work i would almost need see that's what i was afraid of can we fussy cut this i don't know y'all i mean can we suppose we can try i'm trying as i talk yes totally in a panic okay now i don't mind that that's not too bad however i would have to put this on foam which that's okay that's not hard to do I'm okay with that. I'm liking that better. And then having this here, maybe? Okay, maybe. Hmm, I don't know. I'm not 100% sold. Still don't know if I like that one. Things that make you go, hmm, just gotta try. We just, we just got to try. We have one that goes that way. I mean, mm, hmm. I re now I think this needs to be cut right there, right? Like, right, let's just do it. It's done. I don't know, that went underneath my drawer. Oh, no, is that it? No, that wasn't it. I don't know, that piece went shooting across. <laughs> Things are flying. Things are flying. Okay. I like that. Now, I, I really do. I, I'm, I really do like it. Okay. We could go there. Hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm going to make this work. It's happening. It's a happening. Okay. What if, I don't know what, can go here? All right and put the lemons. I mean, I have like two of them. One there. Let's let's hide this lemon under there. 
Okay, like that, and then like that. And in between, have this. I mean, Be Sweet could totally be ha, 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 my title, right? I mean, I'm not opposed, and I think in my ephemera, I have some bees. Okay, then I could act like this was a banner piece. Like, you know how you take strip people? Peeper. <laughs> a strip of paper. What if I were to put it here? Boy, then I'd have to try to line it up. But I totally could, and I could cut it. So let's do it again. <sighs> this is stressful. They may all stressed. <laughs> I'm not stressed. I'm just playing. Okay. Mm, but that does not sit even. See how that, careful with that. I have to do this way. All right. I want it not even that large. So this side is straight. Okay. So then I can take my pen. This might, I think it's gonna be, I can always cut it shorter, right? Okay, and we're gonna cut it again. Guys, I don't know. All right, so here's this. I, I don't necessarily want a lemon up in the poor kid's face. All right. Play with this. This has to go up on foam to make this work, okay? Which is fine. I'm fine with that. I like the way it looks. I kind of, maybe we should turn this just a little so we can tell it's a lemon. Okay, just like so. That's cute. And this could be our title. Then we could come straight up. Yep, totally eyeball it. And we could maybe tuck this in now just like that, like it's a banner piece. Now, I, when I go to glue it down, I will take my ruler and I will measure, okay? And have that like so. I mean, I kind of like that. How stinking cute is that? It's cute. Just saying, I think it's cute. We could go like this and maybe even have just go up the side here, right? With like some florals. Um, tuck this one in lower. Just kind of plan. Just do three. Why not? Okay, there we go. That, oh, I'm loving this. Okay, I do have one more lemon. What if I were to just tuck it in or even go like this? Like a hanging fruit kind of thing. I don't know. Oh, looky there. See, trial and error. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Trial and error. Okay, and then put this because we got to cover this. I mean, we could tuck it in, but I, I can't tuck that side in. To have that just like that. I mean, that is nowhere near where I thought this was going to go. But I really like it now. I do. I really do like it. Okay. I think that's the page, you guys. I, I'm doing a little marinating. However, I think I have a bee in here. Let's look, let's look. Um, look, I have a couple of bees, so you know what I can do? Go like this and like this, they will go on foam. Do I have any more bees or just the two? That would be one, two, three bees. That would totally be okay. It would be bee, bee, bee. Oh, I do have another one, but I, I don't know. I don't think I want another one. I mean, I could. Who says? What am I going to do with that bee? I mean, ah, mm, I don't know. I like the bees up here. You guys know me in odd numbers. <sighs> Two foot the bee or not? Oh, you know what? It doesn't always have to be an odd number. Get that out of your head, Jen. Yep, totally talking to myself. All right, I'll be right back. This is going to be the page. I'm going to glue it down. And we're going to have some fun. All right, hang in there. <laughs> all right, I've got it all glued down. Um, I added some black enamel dots. You probably see some glue drying. You guys know the drill, <laughs> right? Um, I'll put close-ups at the end. Thank you for hanging out with me. I hope this last couple days you're inspired to pull out those full-size pictures, those professional pictures that we have. I hope that it will spark an interest. Pull out your simple stories. Check out everyone else. You guys, be blessed. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Thank you.